there are a couple of different ways that you can change your client status, either from active to inactive, or you can even archive the client altogether. If you want to change your client status to inactive, you can click on the client and click on edit and change them to inactive here. When you go back, it will look like that and just grayed out for inactive and you still have access to that client's information. You could also change it to completed. And again, that will still show in your client's list. If you have too many clients in your list and you want to organize it a little bit, you can also archive the client by clicking on their name. If you'd like to archive the client, you can click on this little file box here. This tells you that it will remove the client from the list along with any invoices, payments, and paperwork. And you can restore the client later if you want. And it's asking if you'd like to continue. So I'm going to hit archive. And it disappears from this list here. To find that client again, you can click on view archive and the client will be here. If you'd like to put them back into your list, you can just hit unarchive like that. When you restore them, it will restore their invoices, payments, and paperwork as well. And when you go back to the list, you can see that they are here back in your list.